Hey everybody, so you have a MacBook Air, MacBook Pro, and you're just tired of when this happens. So if we shut it off, and we leave it off, and we do close the lid, and then when we open the lid again, it just turns on. Or, if we just shut it off, and maybe, you know what, we just want to close it and then maybe just give it some charge for the next day. Just want to plug it in so it's going to have some charge for the next day. We plug it in and it keeps turning on regardless of what you do. So you close the lid or you turn it off and you just plug in a charger. You want to charge, it still keeps turning on. There is a way really to turn this off. The Pros from about 2016 to about 2020 and the MacBook Airs from 2018 to 2020, the non-M1 versions. Unfortunately for anyone with an M1, M1 Pro, M1 Pro Max, uh, this method isn't actually gonna go ahead and work out for you. So what do you do and uh, how are we actually supposed to be able to disable this? There has to be some way, right? There is. All right, so the first thing you wanna do is you wanna open terminal. You can open it through the little search up here, the spotlight search, or you can just go to your launch pad. And usually it's located under other. So we wanna click that. And here's our terminal. Now I'm going to make this a little bit bigger. You can press hold command plus just to make this bigger so it's easier for everyone to see. And we want to type in a command. So the command would be, be sudo nvram auto boot equals percentage sign zero zero and that's all you need to do you hit return if it asks for a password uh, just type in your password if you don't have a password for anything it just hitting return is not going to work it's going to make you required to have a password go make a password real quick and then come back and do the same steps over again and then you just hit return i'm going to link the command down in the description below so you guys can just copy and paste it so you don't have to worry about uh, reading this or typing it wrong or typing a space wrong. Um, if you want to go back to default settings, so if you want to be able to go back to the way it was before where you can open and close the lid, no problem, it will be this code. It'll be sudo nvram auto boot and it'll be the same thing but you want to put a 03 instead. I'm not going to do it here because I want to show you guys first but this will be the command for that, if you're interested. All right, so let's go ahead and let's go ahead and see if it works. Let's go ahead and actually go ahead and test it. So I'm gonna go ahead and shut this off right now. Make sure it's turned off. And it's gonna boot, okay. Completely off. All right, so let's try it now. Let's just open it. And you can see it doesn't come on. Let's go ahead and see if it's going to also work with when I plug it in. Because sometimes when you plug it in and charge it, or maybe if you leave it closed, plug it in and charge it, it's going to turn on too. Uh, let's see. So it's charging. It's getting 20 volts. And it's about amp and a half. And it's not turning on. But if we press the power button, it's going to turn on. Just like a traditional laptop or the old days. I do have the M1 Pro here, and I did try it with this one. Um, unfortunately, it just doesn't work for this model. And um, for, I did look it up a little bit further too. It doesn't work for any of the M1 models in general, any of the Apple Silicon. This just won't work for it. We do need to figure out maybe there'll be something in the future that will actually uh, disable those ones. If you guys do know, leave it down, leave a comment down below, and uh, we'll make a follow-up video. So anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Found this video very informative. And uh, if you did, please subscribe for more content. Please leave a like. It really does help us a lot. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.